Well, the vanity dresser and the jewelry box is set up in my daughter's bedroom, and I think she really likes it. Just a few things to note that during this process, I did take some feedback from her. I let her pick out the drawer knobs that were gonna go on it, and then there were a few other aspects of it that I allowed her to change. And so if you look at the thumbnail of the very first video on this series, you'll see what I originally designed it to look like. And then you can kind of compare what it ended up looking like. The jewelry box was originally meant to be a little bit bigger, but she said that she wanted a, something that was a bit more streamlined. So I took it down a little bit. I was also gonna build a mirror to go along with it, a framed mirror, but she said that she wanted to keep the mirror that was already hanging on her wall. So uh, those are the aspects that she wanted. And those are the aspects that I tried very hard to incorporate into the vanity dresser. So hopefully she likes it. Just a few things to go over. Some of you expressed some interest in what I actually did with the shallow dado that I put on the vanity dresser top. That is a story of blue tape and some Cabernet stain. I've also used a dark colored paint before and it looks just fine. Also, even though I used blue tape to try and keep the Cabernet where the Cabernet was supposed to be, I still tried very hard not to get it on the tape because sometimes it has a tendency to bleed under. And then you're stuck trying to sand that down. But that's precarious at best because you're dealing with a very thin veneer on the plywood. So it's just best to try and do the best you can from the very beginning. I think that looks pretty good. And the dowels lend a nice touch to it as well. Well, that's it. I'm pretty happy with the way it turned out. It looks good and I had fun doing it. So now it's on to other projects. I have some shop organization I'd like to tackle and I also have some hand planes I'd like to restore along with lots of other projects planned for 2015. So I hope you'll join me for that. Hey, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. Check me out on Facebook and Pinterest. If you like this video, here's a couple more you'll like as well. Until then.